All right. So, um, Metal Gear Solid 3, all keratin frogs on the uh, PC version of the Master Collection. I have not done this run yet. In fact, I haven't even finished a run of MGS3. I have just not played uh, MGS3 yet in this. Um, third person, camera up and down should be reversed. Own view should be normal, though, I think. Camera left, right, fine. Captions on. Yep, that should all be fine, I think. Uh, new game. I like MGS3 because I want certain things. Um, all right, hopefully this all works. After the end of World War II, the world, the world was split, split into, into two, two. East, East and West. West. This marked the beginning of the era called the Cold War. Jack. All right. Here we go. Time to play MGS3 on PC. Um. I don't think I... I don't have to show a FPS... I don't have to show FPS on this, do I? I don't think so. Also, I didn't know game... Did gamepad... Did gamepad viewer get an update to, um, to have the centre button get pushed? Because the centre button now shows up when I push it. Which is really helpful. One frog! Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> yeah, she even unlocks. Shoot a keratin frog for the first time. Uh, the auto splitter seems to be working. That's nice. Uh, so, for those who don't know this run, uh, it is fairly straightforward. Uh, it is just simply complete the game whilst also collecting, uh, whilst also shooting every single keratin frog. Um, I should. Uh, but at the end of the run, I should get the carrot. I should get the keratin, um, keratin achievement. Uh, as you saw there, um, as you saw there a second ago, um, I did just for the first time get the achievement for shooting a keratin frog for the first time. I, I literally just, I haven't done this at all yet. I'll take that guy out. I'll take that guy out. Take that guy out. Roll over him. And just before we move, I'm going to shoot that frog over there. Got it. I saw it move. Hopefully I don't get the um, the long loading screen here. Nope, no long loading screen. Nice. That was a problem on the Xbox version where um, if you went into that with like an alert or something, you could just um, you could get the the long load. Shoot that one. Uh, now, because luckily, because um, with the PC version, they've um, oh oh yeah, I'm gonna get every every single story achievement as well. By the way, folks, um, yeah. So because um, because this is the PC version, they included um, loading remove times because they can because we now have an auto splitter. Um, I to the best of my understanding, the um, the Xbox Series. S and X version of the Master Collection might now be the fastest. Um, but, to be honest, for P because PC's off on its own separate category now, it doesn't really matter. Oh, shit. X. Uh, 
Uh, what have I gone wrong here? It's been a while. It's been a while. There we go. Uh, so that should have that should have been all of the. Um, no, don't want to save. Uh, that should have been all of the uh, all of the frogs for the first section. I don't think I missed any. Pretty sure I got them all. Um, I have the word true. <laughs> I have the word true showing. I think that might be the, um... I think that might be the, um, whether the game is loading or not. I pretty much just downloaded it, downloaded the splits, and that was about it. So the t yeah, so the timer now stops running because it's false. That makes sense. Uh, I haven't looked into, like, whether there's a keratin... Uh, keratin timer. Li literally, I've set this up during the break. <laughs> like, instantly. But like, I gotta say, these lo like these loading times are just beautiful. Alright, um, because this is all keratins, I do now need to um, run it back. Uh, so run all the way back through um, Swampland. Grab the um, grab the character. Grab the keratin in here on the way back. It's easier to grab it on the way back than it is to grab it on the way in. Uh, yeah, even though we've already got the frogs in in here uh, during um, uh, the Versus mission, they don't count. They they move. So we have to go and uh, we have to go and get them again. So for here, I'm going to roll here. Oh, roll down to here, and then the frog is there, and now we can leave. Ah, the uh, the splits are a little um, a little messed up here because it's just sim simply every time I move a room, I should have added um, I should have added some extra splits because I was not aware of how it would work. Uh, next one is there. Oh man, it is so nice to have the PlayStation 3's aim on a nice version of this. It really is the best of both worlds. All right, so that's presumably gonna. There we go. So I think actually, I think all it's. Um, it might be the way the auto splitter works is that as whenever um, loading changes from false to true, um, it might split. It might not actually be determining the um, different changes. I don't. I don't know. I don't know how it works. Take that guy out. Uh, there is a frog. Oh, I'm not stood in the best spot for this one. There is a frog here. There we go, we're back onto uh, the auto split is in the right place now. Take him out. Uh, next frog is just on my right. Let's just turn here. There we go, shoot that one. Again, frogs, frogs moved again in here. Oops, I've actually gone past it. <laughs> the frog's there. Whoops, did this the wrong way. Just walk back out again. Alright, time for the ocelot unit. 
Oh, whoops. God damn it. That's the ocelot unit done. <sighs> not not bad ocelot unit. I, it took me a minute to remember exactly what you're supposed to do with that ocelot unit. Uh, but I got there in the end. Back to the easy gun. Cool. I think I I think I'm good. I think I'm doing well. It's been a long time since I've done this run. But it feels, to be honest, it, it feels lovely to play. Like there's, a, there's been a lot of complaints about the Master Collection, and I completely understand uh, where the complaints come from. But just sort of the, the base, what you actually get, the, the base game is just fine. Um... Yeah, the the main experience here. I think the for me the 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 biggest offender is MGS One. Like the fact that there's no there is nothing with it, nothing done to MGS One at all. And I'm I am by in, by no means suggesting that uh, yeah they should have added 4K resolution and 60 FPS. No, just some you know some sort of basic upscaling would have been nice. You know. Any, any sort of upscaling at all would have been an improvement. You know, the game... You can make the game look really nice on a PS1 emulator. And it just looks like ass. <laughs> looks like complete ass. But as far as MGS 2 and 3 are concerned, I don't really think there's any problems. I'm still annoyed that MGS1 Konami still hasn't even acknowledged that um, 360 degree analog doesn't work. Like they keep put, they keep putting out in every um, patch list they do. They put out a list of um, everything that's been fixed and everything that they're still aware of that they're still fixing, and they've not even acknowledged it. They they do not put in their notes to say that um, that they're missing. That, that that functionality is missing. And it's really not on. Alright, Ocelot. Oh, I didn't get the sh... I didn't get the shot off, so this is going to be terrible. From that range, huh? talk, huh? Yeah, this isn't this isn't going to work. Got the frog though. Alright, that was terrible, but whatever. Oh, wow, look at how easy it is to see in here. Oh my god, it's so easy to see in here. Um, where am I going? I know where I'm going. Jesus, this is even better than the Xbox Series S. For seeing in here. Even, yeah, even you guys can see what's going on. This is such an improvement. <laughs> like I used to, I used to have to put on a filter so that so that everyone could see in this. 
This is great! Yeah. Congratulations, folks. This is what the caves look like. Uh, and that was the caves. That was the cave frog. Probably, probably the longest and most annoying frog in the game. Because we now just have to go all the way back to the start of the caves and redo it. It's just a really annoying frog. Uh, and now we just have to go all the way through. All the way through the normal way. Because there's only one route through the caves and it's this hole. You ha you, there's no way out of the caves without going through this, uh, this cubby hole. Yeah, as I said before, I actually haven't really played MGS2, uh, MGS3 yet on the Master Collection. This is my first proper playthrough of it. Um, I played a little bit of MGS... I think I did the tanker on MGS... In fact, actually, I think I might have completed MGS2. I can't remember. Um... Um, but, yeah, there's... You know, I'm just three. This is this is great. I, I can't complain about this. I I know that there were some there were some issues with some textures. Um, and it's not like the splitter camo texture was and um, the uh, splitter face paint was like really bad. Um, um, and I think there were some other problems. Um, but I mean, my experience so far of this, it I say it's great having it's great having the um. The PlayStation 3's version of aiming. That was a bit awkward, because I forgot what I was doing. Okay, not too bad. Uh, hello! Uh, oh, hey, Lavery. The, um, the Twin Stakes bingo was interesting. <laughs> Uh, it took a very long time. <laughs> also, just going to point it out, folks. How are we now 17 minutes in to a keratin's run? And I haven't once seen the keratin emote. Where are you guys at <laughs> with the keratin emote? This is unacceptable. Very disappointed. To here, not too far, because there is a. Uh, there's some. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Thanks, Omni Tunes. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Good. <laughs> uh, I don't actually know if the um, if you can still do the out of bounds trick here. Guess we're not going to find out. <laughs> Helps if I actually shoot it. <laughs> Big fishies. Um, I have um, I have put a couple of mods onto this, but they're not. Um, n there's no mods that affect gameplay. Um, it's like um, resolution scaling. So there's a there's a resolution scale because by def uh, by default the game will only run at uh, 1080. I think. Um, so this is upscaled further to 1440. Um, 
I've also got, um, I think there's a, um, a, a higher resolution textures or something. I'm sure there's something else. Um, oh, and the um, borderless. Um, proper bo um, borderless mod as well. Yeah. Whatever I've put on, it's all working as, as I'd hope. This is, this is running beautifully. I don't think I hit that. No, there we go. I can hear that croaking. One thing I am looking forward to with MGS3, I, I do want to do this with MGS3 now, um, is it should be possible to do an all achievements run. Um, all achievements was always a pain in the ass with the console versions of this, which is you can't reset your achievements. Uh, Steam, incredibly easy to reset your achievements. So I really do hope that I can do um, some all achievement runs at some point. Hey, Malefic. Long time no see. Uh, switch to that gun. Shoot that barrel. Shoot that barrel, I think. Alright, hopefully I got this right. Uh, no, the reinforcement's already here. Got to try and get past these without falling in the water. Yeah. If this happens, you just have to deal with it. It's not that bad. Bum. Oh, I mean, I mean it. That's the important thing. Frog. Got him. Cobble box. Roll up some stairs. Uh, I'm assuming because it is exactly the same game engine. Snake's hitbox is massive. Oh, I um, didn't actually hit him. Never mind. Uh, I seem to have, I seem to have um, skipped a split somewhere. Oh, because I went off and grabbed... Um, yeah, I know where I went. I went off to an extra room to get a keratin. What's that one? Yeah, I just need to... I need to go um, go back in and, and add... Add some extra splits to this. The auto splitter was not designed with... Um, keratin frogs in mind. Uh, we don't get the frog there. Uh, we also don't get the frog here. Um, yet we get the frog on the way out. Uh, scientist costume. Uh, and keratins, we do actually want the scientist costume. Huh? Not so fast. What is it, officer? Get Come ba on back to the lab. And now that we're back in the lab, uh, back to Olive Drab. Oh, that's not the easy gun. That's the mic. Shoot the frog. There we go. Ah, oh, thanks, dude. Hmm. I don't know when the next stream is going to be, unfortunately. This is only a one-off um, for Christmas because, uh, you know, fatherhood kicked in. Oh, I hate this window. No. No. Oh, fucking go through snake. There we go. <coughs> got there in the got there in the end. Take out the frog. Uh, 
of course the uh My splits are, my splits are still a little all over the place because I've got extra. <laughs> Thanks. Um, my splits are still a little all over, all over the place because I'm still having to go to different rooms than a normal any percent run. Uh, I don't know if I'd have to rewrite the auto splitter in any way um, to accommodate it. Hopefully, it's just just it shouldn't shouldn't be. It should just be extra splits. Take out him. Let's get out of here. Turn. Shoot the frog. Oh my god, aiming is so much better. I really, I really do think this is the, this now is the definitive way to play um, MGS3. This is so much better than... So much better than console. Swap to stun grenades. Alright, it's time for the fear. I hope I did this right. I pushed the wrong button. I think he's at the wrong he's in the wrong place. Let's see what happens. No, I fucked this up. Uh, you have to um Oh brilliant! I hope you enjoyed it. Did you watch my video about the boba skip? Because you watched um, Son of a Glitch first. That's the thing that I'm most interested in at the moment. <laughs> Why is he start? He started in the wrong place. This is wrong. Something's wrong. This fight isn't going the way it's supposed to go. The end should st the the fear shouldn't be starting in that position. The end he should be above me. I don't hmm I'm not sure what's wrong. This is so wrong. <laughs> this is really dumb. Right, you know what? New plan. We're gonna do the we're gonna do this the non VE way. Cause I don't quite understand what's happening. Oh. 
Problem is I haven't done the I haven't done the non VE way in so long I can't bloody remember how it's done. Why is this screwing up so badly? It should be that you use the fake death pill and the fear approaches you from the top right. But he's not. I'm so... Okay, that was a lot better. I'm so close. seem to bloody hit him. There we go. Okay, that was insane. I need to have a... I need to... I need to do some research on that. That was dumb. I don't know why that's changed. Uh, cure... Uh, leech. <laughs> For what it's worth. Oh, I get the bloody cutscene. Um, venom poison is a serum. We leave the arrow in. All right, we take a, a short break from keratins. Whoops. Oh my god, <laughs> rolling here is terrible. Right. Oh, that's cool. It's just a, a recommended video for you. Yeah, uh, um, uh, a, I think it's, I think the channel's called A Plus Start, um, which is a, um, does a series called Son of a Glitch, which is all about glitches and video games. Uh, a couple of days ago did a video all about Metal Gear Solid 1 and the glitches, and pretty much every single glitch that was covered is useful in speedrunning. Um, but they, um, they refer referenced my, um, Boba Skip video. Um, when talking about the Boba Skip. Um, they didn't actually mention it in the video. It was, um, they, they put the, um, they put a tag to it and it was in the description, which was nice. It's always, always nice to get some recognition. Um, it's happened, happened a few times. My, my Boba Skip video has been, uh, covered by Abisoft, uh, Carl Jobs. I'm sure there was someone else who did it, but I can't remember. <clears throat> I know, we're not going that way. We're going this way. Uh, so I am going to have to... Um, I'm going to have to do splits again, because that's going to split when I don't want it to. Uh, it's about Gorni East. <clears throat> little detour just to get this next keratin. Run all the way over here. Roll up this hill. Stand next to the tree, and the keratin is behind there. It's a bit difficult to aim at this one. That didn't move. There we go. Now it bumped. Now it bounced. That's good. <clears throat> New follower. Thank you very much for uh, for the sub on YouTube. This is very kind of you. I do have a new YouTube series starting soon. Um, swap to sun grenades and unequip them. <clears throat> All right. Um, the end. Uh, the end's a funny little bugger in um, in all keratins. So I'm going to equip the stun grenades. Avoid his shot. Stand here. Throw three stun grenades. 
shoot him in the head. Shoot him again. Shoot him again. Don't shoot him anymore. Yes, he's gone left. Wonderful. Uh, where's the bloody hell's the frog? Um, where's the frog? There it is. Excellent. So when you when you do this trick, you'll notice actually he's he's on almost no health, uh, almost no stamina. He just needs one more hit. Um, he'll either go left or right. If he goes left, you get a quick end. If he goes right, you get a slow end. Uh, so from here, whenever he goes left, he always goes to the same position. So all I'm going to do is come to here. I'm going to shoot the frog here. Turn around. And the end is there. And the end is defeated. Uh, and that is um, that is the end. And then once we've done, we just come over here. Stand here. Look down there. And the frog is there. Got it. Saw it bounce. Uh, and that is how you defeat the end and get all three keratin frogs very, very quickly. Uh, we now need to do a backpack change. Uh, I need to get the Mosin the Gun out. And I also need to get Cardboard Box A out. So yeah, if he go if he goes right, you have to follow you still have to follow him. Um Follow him, defeat him, go and get that, go and get the frog that I just got in here. And then once you've done that, you then have to go um, into the west area. Uh, so my split, I only need to split once. Or back then, go back a split once. Uh, the frog for here is here. And now we make the, uh, the climb up. Oh, it's a good time for a drink! Yes, yeah, so I was saying a minute ago, um, I have got, if you, are, if you are watching on YouTube, or if you're watching on Twitch and you want to go and check out YouTube, um, I have got a new, um, a new show starting on YouTube soon. Uh, once I've finally sorted out my microphone and the, um, got it to a, a state that I'm happy with, because it's, and I've, I've gathered this from a couple of people tonight, that it still doesn't sound quite right. Uh, so I need to, I still need to do some tweaks. Um, but it sounds better. It sounds deeper. It's, um, it's a, it's a much nicer sound, a much more bassy sound. Um, so once I've got that, I'm happy with that, and I can then actually start recording. Um, I have got a new a new series starting. It is called um, Speedruns Explained in 400 Seconds. So it will be a it will be a full speedrun, edited down for the important bits, the funny bits, the entertaining bits, um, and the whole the whole speedrun. No matter how long the original speedrun is, the video will take 400 seconds to show the speedrun and show the bits of it. Um, there'll then be a a YouTube short. Uh, a TikTok short, which will be uh, 60 seconds, same thing, so I've got to try and explain the whole run in 60 seconds. Um, but also the original recording of the run in its entirety is also going to be available to view as well. Um, so yeah, that's going to be good. Um, YouTube's doing me really well already. It's, I've only been YouTube partner for a month and I'm already going to get a payout, which is really nice, considering the threshold, 60 quid. Um, Actually, looks like I'm gonna do better. I'm gonna do better on YouTube for a while um, than I have been doing on um, on Twitch, which is really interesting. All right, just run across here. You, uh, you may have already seen the frog. There it is. Now we head up the mountainside. Uh, I don't know if I've got any stun grenades, so I'm going to get that just to be on the safe side. 
Whoops. <laughs> I was not quite prepared for that. No. <laughs> Stop that. Getting up here with an alert isn't too much of a problem. It's the next room. I just gotta make sure that I, like, don't lose my alert. Uh, it's also the fact I've got a frog to shoot here. Oh my god. <laughs> Guards, fuck off. I can't shoot it. <coughs> got it. Go, go, go. Get out of here. <laughs> The RPG. Alright, uh, so now that I'm in here, I can't lose this alert. I need to keep it. Uh, normally, I normally I get the keratin on the way up, um, but it's going to be easier to get it on the way out just because I've, I've got the alert. I'm just hoping the oh, <laughs> uh. I'm just hoping the fact that I went down to an evasion doesn't halt go against me here. No, oh, it does bollocks. Damn, this is a time loss. If you come in, if you come into here with an alert and keep the alert, then um, you don't have to wait for this to disappear. I now have to wait for the evasion to go down to her. To a caution. I suppose actually... As I gotta wait anyway. Might as well get the frog. <laughs> There we go. I should now be able to go through. Yep, there we go. That's one of the lot. That's one of the longest loads in the game. Nah, screw this. <laughs> Mosin the gun, that shit. <laughs> Back to the easy gun. There's a frog in here. So don't need to get the frog now, I've already got it. Whoops, screwed that up. to the Fury, the best boss fight in the game, everyone's favourite. I don't I I I don't fear the Fury as much as other people do. I don't think he's that bad. Uh, my best tip for the Fury is if you want to get good at the Fury on any difficulty level, learn to fight him on European Extreme. Nice. <laughs> that's pretty. That's pretty good fury. <laughs> pretty good fury fight. Oh, I'll grab. I'll grab his uniform as it's there. Uh, there's no frog in this room because it's this room is technically part of the previous room.
Um, how did I do this before? It's like that. Yeah. Got him. So there's a few. Um, there's a few to get in uh, Grozningrad, um, and it is going to completely screw up. Screw up the, um, the splits again. Go around this box. I do not want to pick that box up. Enter this hole. Uh, because the frog in the next in the next room is in this vent. Also, I don't like to um, pat my own back too much. I'm actually really surprised at how much of this run I've remembered. Um, the only the only bit I've really screwed up, um, oh, the ocelot fight wasn't very good. I completely screwed up the fear because for some reason the fear seems to be different on the master collection. Um, but overall, I'm I'm quite impressed with how much of this I've remembered. Now we're in North East. I actually, I already have the frog in this room. I do not need to go and get it. Okay, I wasn't intending on shooting Rykov. I don't actually know where that... Hmm. Yeah, I wasn't intending on shooting Rykov. There is a there is a faster method where you get him to run away. And you go and grab him. But I messed it up. But to be honest, messing it up by shooting him is the best way of messing it up. Uh, weapons lab, uh, there is one in the weapons lab, but um, don't go and get it yet. Because it's in there and I can't get in there yet. Um, I can't be asked with the... Um, with the trick. <laughs> uh, there is one frog in here, and this frog is a right pain in the ass. Is there. There we go, he moved. Now I change to Rykov. There we go. Uh, let's take a bit of a break now. Sir. Right. Uh, there's nothing to do here. We can't. I can't control the game. I can't skip this. Uh, we just have to sit and wait for uh, for this lovely, lovely torture section to play out. You monster. <laughs> oh. So, how's everybody doing? I guess he's dead. <laughs> You're having a good time? 
I, I got to say the, this now that I've actually finally had some time to sit down with the you know, the master collection version of MGS3. This is brilliant. This is so good. I I have no complaints about this. So it's only it's only really MGS one that I have a problem with, and that's the the lack of analog, and as I say, the lack of any sort of upscaling at all. Because like with with MGS two and three, you can still you can still upscale it to still upscale it to um to any resolution. You don't really get much from the graphics out of it, but you know it, it's doable. MGS one, you just can't you can't do anything with it. <laughs> And any sort of hardware rendering would have been really nice for it. it. It's stupid that this is the master collection, but you can get a way better experience on MGS1 out of an emulator. There is, there really is no reason to speedrun the master collection version of MGS1. Patient man. Into torture. Um, uh, one four five, one four four point seven five is the number. I've just realised I have no idea. The door has been unlocked. <laughs> there we go. Grab these. I need these smoke grenades. Oops, don't go in there. There we go. And that's how you get that frog. I did so... I I reworked Groznygrad so many times when I was coming up with the routing for this. Um, I used to go in there straight away and grab it before, before it got captured. And then eventually discovered that Johnny dropped some smoke grenades. Um, I did a thing where, like, I got an alert because I used to shoot the uh, the first keratin with a um, with a sniper rifle. So the Groznygrad went through so many different iterations until we finally got got one that we were really happy with. Uh, the far there's still one frog to go, and it's uh, on the stairs to the left over there. It's one that I've uh, I frequently forgot to collect. Well, hey, bum 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 bum. It's Caro. Hey, buddy. Thank you very much for the sub. Poggy woggy woo woo. Nick pajama. <laughs> Nick pajama. And then there was the time. Um, then there was the time we discovered that you don't have to. You don't have to go all the way. Um, all the way to the waterfall and back again to get the next keratin because there's SAA ammo at the top of that ledge. Then that chain, then that changed because I then discovered the smoke grenades that were on Johnny. Let's say this this run changed so much, uh, and I did I did actually start uh, routing um, European Extreme for this. I would at some point like to go back and do it. Out of all of the speedruns I've ever done, Keratin's from GS3 is one of my favourites. In fact, after Twin Snakes, after Twin Snakes Normal, and I'm biased against, I'm biased for Twin Snakes Normal because it's the run that got me into GDQ. <laughs> um, MGS3 All Keratin's is probably my favourite speedrun. Thanks, dude. Okay, so um, loading remove to loading remove time doesn't include uh, it does now include the sorrow, which means potentially getting the um, that presumably means grabbing the um, uh, handkerchief is now faster per PC because it's technically RTA, it's not IGT. 
Uh, for, those, for those who don't know, the um, only the PC version of um, the Master Collection. On only the PC version of the Master Collection, instead of um, instead of it being done by IGT, um, timing is done by loading remove time because it was. I can't actually remember why um, it ended up being like that. Gotcha. <laughs> Took me a few attempts, but I got there in the end. Yeah, I can't remember why they... I, I think it's to do with, like, low... Because I, because, um, I think it might have been the IGT wasn't consistent between different people's machines. No, Snake, don't do it. It might have been inconsistent between different people's machines. Um, and so they discovered that, you know, they could just do loading remove time. Which is good. I'm, I'm, I don't have any complaints about it. Um, I think my, my only concern with it is, um, oh, come on, Nick, stop doing this, you idiot. My only, my only concern with it is I, I like things being the same. I, you know, it, to me, it makes more sense that they're all, you just use IGT for all of them. Um, it also throws up into the air, like, um, keratins actually doesn't matter because, um, This is what I was always confused about with um, with the emulator, because um, when we introduced when we used, introduced emulator runs, um, emulator was done with load and remove time. Um, bingo was fun. It took me two hours to complete a run. It was pretty funny. Um, when yeah, when emulator first got introduced. Um, it was done with loading remove time. So the the main difference with loading remove time, um, um, oh no, I know what I'm doing. The main difference with loading remove time is that the time ends when the credits start, not when the credits end. So automatically, PC and emulator has a massive time advantage. There it is. There's the SAA bullets I wanted. Um, already has a massive time advantage um, as a result. Because um, you don't have nine minutes of credits to get through. Um, so it means for th it meant at the time for things like Keratin, because it, Keratin's a category extension. And, um, oh, I need to... Uh, no... No, I don't need to do anything with that. It's backpack. Uh, get rid of that. Get that out. Get rid of that. Get that out. Get that out. I don't think I need the Mosin Nagant. I do need stun grenades. I don't need smoke grenades. I do need C3, and that's it. Um, I don't need anything from in. No, I don't need anything from in there. It was... um. <coughs> It used to be um, when you're learning the run, it's recommended you uh, take a fake, take the fake death pill. Oh, I need cub. I need the cardboard box, idiots. I need box B. There we go. Um, so yeah, um, ker um, all keratins was on um, is on category extensions, and all category extensions didn't used to have any separation between like difficulty um, or anything like that. Um, or console, you know, the um, exactly how you ran it. Uh, there was no difference. So it always meant that Xbox Series S was the fastest version until Emulator came along, where Emulator automatically saves like eight minutes. Oh! Well, hey! Nateless, thank you very much for the sub. Very kind of you. So much love tonight. It's been, it's been so, it's been so nice to come back. Um, you know, I'm, I'm truly, I'm truly sorry that it's not gonna, um, truly sorry that it's not gonna last. Uh, I don't know when my next stream is gonna be. Um, but that's why I'm trying to do this more, more stuff on, uh, more stuff on, on YouTube instead. Oh, shit. I did a boo-boo.
All I gotta do is wait for this evasion to clear. That was a bit silly. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know when my next stream is going to be after this. Um, hopefully, I'll get some time in the new year to do one. Um, no. Oh, bugger! Um, this is really dumb. <coughs> Excuse me. The alert's slowly wearing off. <laughs> um, I think me and ha me and Heidi have discussed it because um, you know eventually we both want to get back to both doing doing stuff and having a life, um, and um, I, I say having a life, having a life outside of just being parents. Um, you know, at the moment our lives are pretty much her life in particular is very much just she is a mum and that is all she does. Um, my life is I'm a dad and I get a little bit of time in the evening to play games, but I'm also still working. Um, um, but where, but she's probably going to go back to, um, go back to band, uh, and do band stuff again. Um... Right, no. <laughs> There we go. That was alright. Um You know, so she's gonna she's she's gonna wanna you know um, go back to band. I'm gonna wanna start streaming again. But of course if either of us are doing either of those things, then someone has to look after the baby. And um her the thing is in in the past, um her band and my stream worked out really well because my stream was Tuesdays and Thursdays. I can hear it. I can hear it croaking. I got it. Um, her her band was Tuesdays and Thursdays, um, and my stream was Tuesdays and Thursdays. So when I was streaming, she'd be out of band, and you know it's not like either of us were alone that evening. Obviously, when we go back to this, we can't do that because someone's got to look after the baby. Um, so you know she doesn't. Really, she has. She's got. She's not got a choice. As to when um, she goes to band. Band is Tuesday, Thursday, and they're not going to change that. I, on the other hand, do have a choice. I can stream whenever I want. So it's very likely when we come back to... When I do come back to streaming, I'm going to be doing Monday, Wednesday from now on. Oh, beautiful shot. There we go, just to make sure. Uh, so yeah, if you want that Tuesday Thursday slot, it's not going to be a problem for me because I'm very likely going to be swapping. I mean, the other, the other thing that I could probably start doing after Christmas is doing some weekend streams. Um, I have much more time, much more time during the day uh, to do stuff. Oh, wow. All right. Time for some annoying frogs. God, loading times are so good on this. I did uh, I did deliberately install the whole of the master collection onto my um onto my best my my main SSD. There we go, got it. Got him. I used to be so bad at um third uh, not aiming not aiming with this um 
with the RPG. Got him. Part of a bigger mod team. Does that mean you're uh, modding for someone quite big? Right, move on to the runway. Uh, for this bit, I want to get the easy gun out. I want to try and shoot the uh, passengers. Uh, this is actually a um, a harder difficulty sh harder difficulty strat. Um, if you take out if you take out the bikes themselves, um, oh shit! <laughs> if you take out the bikes, they'll respawn. If you only take out the passengers, they don't. Um, and whilst the drivers will shoot you, it's a lot more difficult for them to hit you. I now want the SVD out because the frog is there. There we go. So yeah, the uh, the drivers will still shoot you, uh, but they uh, their aim is terrible. Um, I'm not going to die, that's not the problem. It's when you get shot, there is a bit of a reflex. Um, and you don't really want that when you're trying to, you know, shoot a keratin frog. On to the next bit. The frog is there. Yep, I've got it. You can just you can just hear it. <laughs> I think I've already done enough damage to it. I can do a little bit more damage to it, but it's not going to... I don't think it makes much of a difference at this point. Yeah, I've done it. I've done enough that. I think you only, you only have to do like a, a quarter of it. Onto the rail bridge. Actually, stand up because the uh, the frog is there. You can't can't shoot that frog lying down. Uh, Snake has perfect aim in uh, third person like this. There we go. Uh, one that's uh, one reason to use. Um, I'm just going to concentrate on this bit of the fight. Perfect first shot. Oh. Oh, I got it! I freaking got the keratin. This is a shame I've not got the, um... I've not got this fight down. Yeah, you can hear, you can hear the, uh, keratin croaking. That's good, that makes this, um... Second half much easier. Don't have to worry about shooting the frog. All right, it's been a while. So I think I'm going to play this safe. I'm going to I am going to play this safe just so for those who are uninitiated with the um, Carrot and Frog collection. Uh this is um 
Uh, this room is the namesake of my computer. <laughs> uh, I uh, earlier earlier in the year, just before it was in October, just before I became a dad, uh, I won a uh, I won a computer uh, from Overclockers. Overclockers were giving away uh, a massive Starfield um, themed computer, uh, and I happened to be the person to win it. Um, I asked the community what I should call it. I tend to call it, uh, give it, give computers names after Metal Gears. So yeah, you know, my first computer was called Rex. I've had uh, for the longest time my computer's been called the Shagahard. Um And the suggestion that came up um, for this computer was Hellfrog, uh, and that is what it's called. And it's named after the keratin frog in this room. Uh, we call this this frog um, Hell Frog because the frog appears right at the end of the room, um, and if you miss it, the run is dead. Um, so in order to prepare for it, I deliberately take loads of damage so that um, I don't um, I can kill myself quickly if I miss it. I've got it. I got it. You can hear it croaking. Because if you miss it, that is how much time you have to kill yourself and reset the room. It's horrible. It is the worst frog in the game. I am terrified. Got him? I am absolutely terrified of doing a... Um, of doing an all achievements run. Um, because of that frog. For all achievements, you are required to get all keratin frogs. There is an achievement for getting all of the keratin frogs. Um, but there is also an achievement for not killing anybody. You are not allowed to kill anyone. You must complete the game with a zero kill count. Uh, the problem with that frog is that the easiest way of sh killing it, of, of shooting it, is to use this RPG and um, and get an explosion near it. The problem is that there's guards nearby that you're going to kill. So the only other way of doing it is to use the SVD and be very, very good. It's how I used to take out that frog. I used to take out the frog with the SVD anyway, and I got a little bit good at it, and then I discovered that I was so much better than, with the RPG. Only one more bike frog to go. And there he is. There we go. Oh, I actually hit evil with that. Whoops. Alright, there they are. Uh, so that's all the uh, that's all the bike frogs. Uh, in fact, there are only three more frogs in the game. Assuming I haven't missed any. Uh, and as I said before, um, this is automatically world record. Uh, because no one has done this run yet. Unless there was any other prerequisites I've not done, um, I didn't actually in, in I didn't actually check <laughs> to see if there was anything I was supposed to do. Like, am I supposed to have the frame rate on display? I mean, I've got the loading remove time and RTA showing, so I think that counts. <laughs> um. <coughs> I'm not. I'm not sure. All right, now we feed Eva. Let me have 
have some more. And then cure, Eva. Set don't need to do anything else. Leave Eva behind. Do not need to, uh, to follow in this first bit. All right. Uh, and now we do a slight detour from a normal speedrun. Uh, in a normal speedrun, we go right because it's quicker. Uh, in this speedrun, however, we go left because there's a keratin frog. I want to get nice and far away from her because there will be some guards chasing us. I do need to take them out. Get all the way up on this hill. Um, you got to be careful um, shooting these guards because um, if you aim in the direction of Eva, she'll stop. And duck. But it looks like I'm okay. It looks like I'm out of the... Um... That, should, that should be all of them. The frog's down here. So all we've got to do is just check, make sure. Doesn't look... Yeah, it looks like I shot all three of them. There shouldn't be any more following. Oh no, there is one more following, but I don't think he'll reach me. Uh, so then finally, as we head into this, this little bit here, just got to make sure... Just gotta make sure that um, Eva doesn't get left behind. Dun, dun, dun. Because uh, Eva will rat like Eva can very easily just wander off in a very different direction. Um, like, if she's not close enough to me, she'll go, she'll go down and round that log instead of, um, instead of following me. So it's very important you get that right. Uh, we now have, um, the frog that the community lovingly dubs the Freeg. She's still following me. Uh, so yes, the uh, community um, <laughs> lovingly dubbed this one the Freak. We've had Hellfrog, the worst frog in the game. We now get the Freak, which is the freest frog in the game. Because uh, we have to wait for Eva anyway, and it's just here. There we go. Does not lose, does not loses any time. Ugh, Eva's gone round and round the trees. I mean, technically, all of the bike frogs don't lose us any time. Um, but they're also quite difficult to get. <laughs> that one is super easy. Cool. Only one more frog to go. Assuming I've got them all. I do need to check and see if the, um... Either if the um, the auto splitter already has a, a keratin frog tracker, if it doesn't, then I'm gonna make it myself. <laughs> I should be able to figure it out. Well, depends if it's a it depends if it's a simple um, a simple tracker or not. It might not be a number. It might be some sort of array. There we go, just one more frog to get. Let's see what you're made of. Uh. Excellent, Jack. Yep, there we go. All keratins. I got the achieve. I got the achievement. Oh wow! And perfect, perfect boss fight. Absolutely spot on. I could not have done that boss fight any better. Uh, slight time loss because it's the first time I've actually done the run. Uh, because of because it was the first time I've done the run and I um, beat the boss by knocking her out, um, I had to wait around for the um, 
for the um, snake camo. <clears throat> uh, but that's it. That's the run done. Keep it safe. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, now, I believe even for a normal speed run, you still have to... Um, uh, sorry, even for a, um, for a, yeah, a normal PC speed run, even though it's done in, um, even though timing is done by loading remove time and the timer ends as the credit starts, um, I believe you still have to show the score screen. Now I have to show the score screen anyway because I need to show the keratin rank. However, I know I've already done it because I don't think this. No, this doesn't. This doesn't pause it. Uh, nope. Do it. Achievements. It ain't easy being green. Find all 64 keratins. So I already know. I already know that I've got the achievement. There's only room for one boss and one snake. I need to do at some point. What I need to do at some point is create a, is create a save file uh, for doing keratins. Um, the the best the safest save file to create for um, for a keratin run. And that. Category rules. 
there isn't actually anything that says emulator timing method. Timing en to emulate a timing method, the timing ends when credit music starts to play. PC timing method. They haven't actually said. Haven't actually said in the rules when time ends. That's useful. But em emulator emulator is still still showing us um, timing timing en timing ends when end, when credit music starts to play. I don't know if that means that's the same for PC. Um, have a quick, have a quick look at the world record. My issue with that is, is that then when it comes to any run that allows like multiple Metal Gear runs that allows any system, it means that emulator is all automatically has an advantage. Okay, in the world record run by Vermillion, it includes the whole of the credits. So, PC, PC does still include the credits. As I say, I'd have to, I'd have to ask, I'd have to ask about. Um, multiple Metal Gear runs, because that really would suggest that Emulator is... <coughs> Emulator is now the fastest version. Which is, in my opinion, a little dumb. But I think they might make an exception that says for Emulator you still have to go and see the end credits. I certainly want it to be that way. Ba 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 Oh well, it's one vi one video I can't monetize. Never mind. So the other thing I'm curious about is I know I had a I had a massive issue with um with the fear, but that was the only thing that really went wrong in this run. Everything else was fine. Everything else was kind of fine. Um. So yes, it does make me wonder, therefore, the the how does that actually compare my world record? Oh, I'm not the only person to have done this. I understand, sir, but they were well, on PC I am, but uh, on console there are three. So go he and uh, you and yes, Kit. The CIA has oh, that's taken cool. Care of the boss um, my world record uh, on console, so on the Xbox the Series was S, uh, was 1 hour 21.17. Uh, so yeah, this is about five. This is five minutes slower, at least. By the time this this bit's ended, it's probably going to be about six yes, or seven minutes slower. The American president is um, on us but to keep I think that will be down fair. to mistakes. I did make I did make goals. a few mistakes and lost quite a bit of time. A yeah, there's plenty of time that could be um, picked up in this. Yes, um, for all keratons, PC yes, currently has no runs. I'll keep the cage uh, an time. emulator currently has no runs. I thought I did an all keraton all emulator run. I'll have to check that. I'm sure I did an um, emulator or keratin run at one point. Keratin. Yes, it's me. The boss has accomplished her mission. Metal Gear Solid 3 4. I've, I've typed in keratin on my own channel. In I've got an HD edition, other very easy. I've got a speedrun tutorial. 
I've got yes, an HD and a D edition other very easy 10847, and then my trilogy speed run. I've got a, a PS3 emulator run, <laughs> Peking must be in an which right won't right count because um, it's only Xenia, the Xbox so. uh, emulator well, we that's uh, valid for keratin, uh, for, uh, for speed running. You're not allowed to use KGB the PS3 emulator. Part of the legacy. Yes, the weapon has been reduced to ashes. That's right. Grozny Grad has been obliterated by the Davy Crockett we brought in as well. Yeah. So no, I've never, I've not done this run on emulator. Yes, so the there you go. If I do this run on emulator as well, then that's two more world records under my belt. Speaking of which, I've obtained something from Granin that you might find interesting. Oh, the Apostle. Revolutionary new nuclear. It was on and on and on and on. It might just come in handy someday. <laughs> yes, we have John. I mean, Snake to thank for that. Khrushchev believed it as well. <sighs> almost done, folks. We're almost yes, there. They our story. I don't think they'll be making a fuss. I don't think they'll be making a fuss. And the secondary alert has been lifted as well. Actually, I do now, sep I do now separate all of my audio out. out. Um, so I might actually be able to, if I edit, if I actually edit the recording of this, I might be able to see the different tracks and um, remove the audio for, um, remove the music for this run. Fingers crossed. Oh my god. Except we all knew, because this game is <laughs> like 12 years old. Mr. Director, ba da ba ba. And time. One hour, 29 minutes, 29 seconds. Uh, and the. Uh, and there is the keratin frog. <laughs> I love cryptic phone calls. 